Hi, this is an A2 Bubbles DIY video about making a small tri-string wand using chopsticks and an old t-shirt. So what we're going to end up with is a small tri-string wand made from a pair of chopsticks with the string itself made from an old cotton t-shirt. And then I like to add a bead at the end. I make them out of Sculpey and I glue them on with uh, Gorilla Glue or something like it. And that's just because otherwise the uh, ends slip off. So I'm going to start out with an all cotton t-shirt. It's clean. It's old. Um, and the first thing I'm going to do is uh, to cut off the hem. Why? Because it's just a little too bulky, so I'm not going to use that part. Now I'm ready to make my first circle of cotton. And I want it to be about an inch wide. It's like about an inch. The truth is, when I get done with this, um, I could make more until I got to this part because I don't want any kind of logo or paint because that could impact the absorbency or just how it works with the bubble solution. Okay, the final snip of my circle. So what do I do next with it is that I'm going to stretch it. And uh, you don't want to get rug burn, as Patty likes to say. I'm Patty. You, know, you could have bamboo chopsticks. And this is really the essentials of what I need. But I like to put something on the end because when I because when I tie the uh, t-shirt onto the wand, onto the skewer, they do tend to slip off. So I have some Sculpey here. Make a little circle. And then stick the skewer in it. Bake it. Typically it's 275 for 15 minutes. I take some Gorilla Glue and glue the bead to the end of the chopstick. I'm going to take a knot like this and uh, this is just, uh, Patty calls it a uh, lark's head. Lark's head. So that's how that looks. Tighten it up and um, then I try to look at like what would be about a third. I make a little knot with that one. Stick it in. Tighten it up a bit. And uh, this is my simple tri-string wand. Got some good bubble juice. This is made with bubble thing, big bubble mix, commercial mix with a little Dawn soap and some water. I just keep the tips together. I dipped it in, fully immersed it. And now I spread it apart. I've got my nice bubble window. Thanks for watching. Keep on bubbling.